Hello there, I'm Crystallized Horse, and welcome to Grandia. Now, pretty old game, I know. But, we're going to start this new game in a new note. Retro Gaming starts. So, let's get a pr little preview of where we're going to be starting off at. Or, with our opening cutscenes. That's pretty nice. I mean, okay. Grandia is a late 90s, 90s game, so take this for example. This is probably the best graphics they had back back then. So don't complain about the graphics. That doesn't make a game. Honestly, that doesn't. And here comes some more credits. Pretty much, these credits are going to be showing pretty much a nice perspective of this, of this game. Pretty much, a lot of things in this game, what you're going to be doing. And right now, I've, I'm replaying the game again. And, God, it's just like, it brings so much nostalgia. It's like, brings back the nostalgia of the 90s. Like, how games used to be back then. And I mean, really, it's just like, one of those things back then, you just like, when you're growing up as a child, and when you play it, replay it about over 10 years later, it just brings that nostalgia back. It's like, right now we're 2011. This game was made back in like 96, 98 on the PS1, I believe. And... This game just brings out a lot of the game. You'll understand it once we get into it. When we really get into the midst of this. So we're just waiting for the opening scene, and hmm. what's going on? It's strange. Uh, I guess I must have dozed off. I had that dream again. The bastards, they're hounding me. Mullen, where are we now? It's only been a half an hour since you asked last. You look tired, General Ball. I keep telling you, Mullen. When there are no soldiers around, you should call me father. Excuse me, but Lieutenant Lean is still here. Oh, <laughs> it's just like you to answer like that. But you know that Lean is a very special part of our military plans, aren't you, Lean? The third excavation of the salt runes is almost finished. I'm counting on you, too. Mullen, lean. We've assigned an elite battalion of our forces to this excavation. I'm sure that we'll hear good news. The current time is 1340 hours. Now passing through Parm airspace. Our ETA is 1530 hours. Hours. Lee, open the viewports for General Ball. Yes, Colonel Mullen. Mm. 
Ooh, that's very bright. It really is bright. Yes, it is. This is the game Grandia, really it is. No jokes, I have, pro I have played the third one before. But this is pretty much the th first one, the first one of the series. Probably the most underrated. People that will only un know this game if you play it back in the 90s. Grania 1 and 3 is very unknown, very underrated. Second one has pop has fame to it, but the first and third one does not have no recognition. Well, the first one has recognition in the 90s, however, the third one doesn't have recognition whatsoever. So just a little game fact for you. So, where are we starting? Who's this? <laughs> Silly little girl. Hmm. What's she doing? Finally, after this Let's Play being started from two months ago, it's finally just now debuted. What the hell? This will teach you, you punk. Oh. <laughs> oh, Justin, not you again. You just don't learn trashing my shit again. I didn't trash it. Why won't you listen to me? I'm staking my pride as a man and my soul as an adventurer on this treasure hunt. Shut up! There's no treasure in all that junk! Now you've completely trashed it. <laughs> anyway, don't ever hunt for treasure in my shed again. You hear me, boy? Ouch! That awful man... He never, ever understands. Justin! Justin, Justin! You okay? That sounded like it hurt. Oh, Sue, did you see that? Don't worry. A punch like that, nothing to it. For a first-rate adventurer, it comes with the territory. Right. So how'd it go? Did you find anything in the shed? Nah, nothing at all. It really was all junk. Must have guessed wrong. But Sue, what about you? Of course I found something! Ta-da! Here it is! The legendary armor! I found it all by myself! <laughs> oh yeah! Puppy helped too! Here you go, Justin. The legendary armor. Dirty apron Great, required. Great, Sue. That's the first one. That leaves the shield of light, the warrior's helmet, and the spirit sword. Don't forget, we gotta get them by sundown or we'll lose. Hmm. Yuck, I don't want to marry that awful god. You know... It's really your fault, Justin. You're the one that took Gons up on his dare. You'd better take responsibility. Okay. I know, I know. Come on. Let's go show this to Gons. Puppy, let's go too. <laughs> <laughs> we found it, Gons. The first treasure. Now we finally got movement controls now. Hmm. 
Now, if you kind of think about it, okay, this is kind of a small town, so you gotta kind of think about it sometimes. So. Pretty much what you're doing around here is just trying to find stuff. That's all you're trying to do. <laughs> Only open at night. Oh lord. chase after him, that's the thing about it. Yeah, so what you're trying to do is pretty much find all the treasures around town now. I haven't got a really good idea of what this... <laughs> of the beginning of this game. I kind of forgot. But I'm running out of time, so in the next part, we will see you. So yes, this is Crystallized Hearts here signing out. Thank you very much for tuning in, and hope to see you next time.